my polo tee, I made a G, bitch, I don't cap a lot Almost popped a fiend selling weed, so I don't trap a lot My bitch mad as hell, I fucked her good, now we don't talk a lot By the time the boys go and get a warrant, it's at another spot Yeah, it's at another house, Glocky in a leather pouch Yo, bitch, fuck on me instead of you, cause you ain't slut her out put, put an AK up to his lips and call it word of mouth If my brother miss a shot, I ain't gon' trip, cause I'ma box you out YouTube, what's up there, it's your boy, every designer around now, I'm back with another video, in today's video, I'll be showing y'all how to convert y'all Eco Tank or Spin ET855 into a DTF printer to start y'all home t-shirt business. Alright, now this is the video that I watched, I advise y'all to watch it if my video don't explain it too well, yeah man, we about to go ahead and get this shot started. All right, so thanks to this lady, I know exactly what to do. She down there popped her shit for real, for real. She was down there doing exactly what needs to be done type shit in this video. 25 minute video, I tried to finish it in like 11. I was skipping around a little bit, but she pretty much explained everything that you need to know. Basically what you will do is you will take your printer out of the box, take off the tape. After you take off the tape, you will power it up. As soon as you power it up in the ink, the printer head start moving. What you would do is you hurry up, unplug it. That way you can take out the rollers. After you take out the rollers, then that's when you apply your ink. So what you would do is you go to Amazon, download, not download, go to Amazon, get your DTF ink from Amazon. And what you would do is once the ink come in, you will switch the S Pen ink, so you'll take out the S Pen ink and you'll put in the DTF ink in that same bottle and then you'll place it in the printer. So, boom, I think it's like right. Okay, so this is when she was explaining where to take the roller out. This is the roller right here. You got the metal piece and the black piece. You take both of them out on both sides, though. See her strike line, she got one side out and she had to go to the other side. This is where she switched that black ink and put in the white ink. And what she'll do is whichever one you put it in, you just do the same for cat link. So boom, she about to put hers right there. As y'all see, it's filling up. Then she gonna put in the rest of the colors as normal. Then after that, y'all see white, white, and then she go blue. And then she just go with her regular colors that she got. Then it's reading it. Once she get done reading, she gonna load up the cat link. And she gonna start her print process. This is cat link for the people that don't know. This is her design. Her design came out a little bit sketchy because, okay, I'm trying to show y'all. Boom. All right, so y'all see the streaks right there. She said what you'll have to do is you have to get some wood and you'll have to place it under, as y'all see right there. And boom, she still had the streaks in her design, but she's still printing out just to see. Y'all see the streaks right here. Uh, what she did was she got some more wood, just made sure the whole thing, the whole area was flat. So it could just come straight out instead of like dipping or anything like that. Then what she did was she applied her adhesive. Um, I don't really know what to call it. But she poured the little um, stuff on the film and then she printed it out. I think it's right here if I'm not mistaken. So yeah, adhesive powder, that's what I was looking for. She applied the powder on the film and then she heated it up with the heat gun. Me, I'm using my press machine to heat it up and then she pressed it down. She waited for it to cool off and then she peeled it. And this is how I look, even with the street sand, it still look nice. So yeah, Ron about to do that with his printer, you know? All right, now y'all see what's going on. We got the Espen Eco Tank ET8550. You know what I'm saying? 
We got the big body Yadi. We just took it out the package. Y'all see the 7.52 a.m. right here. You know what I'm saying? We got the blue joint. And we got the pink joint. You know we had to self-promote. And we'll give y'all some time to read it. You know what I'm saying? Let your heart guide your love. You know what I'm saying? Through storms and sun, love endures. You know what I'm saying? Both of them. They both look pretty over here. Not gonna cap to y'all. But what we about to do is we about to get this printer ready for the DTF printing, direct to film printing. All right, so we did just watch the video as I shown y'all. Um, don't mind the bed for real, for real. It's not really put together. Really just threw on um, a little something, you know? And don't mind the stuff in the background. Gotta peel off all the tape. That's the first little step, you know? So yeah, y'all gonna sit here and watch me do all this. While y'all watch me do all this, make sure y'all shop 752am.com. Trying to do all this on my hand is crazy. But we gonna do it, we gonna manage it. As y'all see them hoodies just a little bit, a little bit old. Those not the new ones that just came off the line, you know, the production line. But yeah, you gotta take off every single piece of adhesive tape. Even though that's not really what it's called, we're gonna call it that anyways, because we got some adhesive powder. Yeah. That one goes off all the way to the back. It's kind of just y'all watching me doing this for a couple minutes. Now, if y'all want to skip through, go ahead and skip through the video. So y'all won't have to watch me peel off all this tape. Kind of trying to do it as fast as I can. Make sure y'all shop 752am.com. Y'all gonna get tired of me saying that, so y'all might as well go ahead and look at it. Boom, another tape piece. Um, I already know if you can lift this up, but at the same time, it's on. Ah, okay, okay. This side, everything come out. Now, we don't want to break nothing. We ain't trying to do too much. Okay, so we found out how to get this tape out. What you have to do is you just have to lift that up. Y'all see my finger mark? Probably gonna get that off of there soon. What you do is you just take that whole thing out, you know? And we just gotta get the rest of the tape off. You don't necessarily have to do this, but y'all know Ron. Ron be doing a little bit extra sometimes. Now we got all the tape off. I'm pretty sure there's no more tape anywhere. And yeah, this is how the big body yaddy look. Now we got that eco tank. This is where the print ink go in. Boom. You got the black, you got the PB, you got the C, you got the Y, you got the M, and you got the GY. Now we not gonna use none of those that came with the printer. We're gonna use our Ta-da, we're going to use our DTF ink. We got the boom. We got the boom. We got the boom. Boom. Yeah, 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 yeah. DTF ink, you know. And we're going to place that right in the printer. So this is going to be the first white, second white. Then that's going to be the regular colors, you know. And then that's going to be the black. And yeah. Espen Eco Tank ET855. All right, so now that we got everything together, we're gonna go ahead and take out the rollers. All right, now this is a little bit different than what I've seen, so I'm gonna go back and watch the videos and figure out how to really do this, you know? Okay, so we just started it up. You press that power button right there to start it up. You gotta plug it into the bed over there. Got the English. We're gonna click English. We're gonna continue set up without the app. Processing. You know, you know. Once that ink head move, you're supposed to unplug it, but we're gonna wait.
Okay, now that we got the printer head moved all the way over, and y'all see the little cord, I'm gonna go in a little bit. All right, y'all see the screws. We got one, two. I think those are the only screws that we got. We gotta take those out, and then we gotta lift this up. And y'all see all our on the inside. Let me see if I can do it. Yeah, 25. All right, once we take the screws out and try and get this little piece out, we'll be good. First thing you want to do is remove this tray right here. I'm going to do both of these black screws. What you'll do is you'll leave them in. Bow, bow, you know. Bro, this is the hardest process in fucking life to get this goddamn roller out. I promise you, God, y'all see the goddamn drill over here, you know? That couldn't fit in a little tight spot that it needed to. So I had to up one of these, you know? Up one of these, take both these screws out. Then under this, it's gonna be a silver plate. Take that silver screw out. Then, what you have to do is you have to fun bustle with this. I thought I broke the whole printer when I popped this boy out, but you pop it out um, on both sides. It took a while. It took some arm muscle, you know, but I eventually popped it out. I think I broke this. That's what kind of scared me, you know, but hey, you got to do what you got to do. All right, so now that that's out, we're going to try and start it back up, see what it says, see what it do. All right, so basically, after you remove the roller, you got to implement your ink. So what we doing now is we just open up each bottle of ink. Can't really set y'all up. Can't really do it one hand. So, yeah. All right, so we got all the ink bottles. We got the magenta, you know. We got the yellow. We got the white. We got the black. We got the extra white over here, you know. This one is pretty much blue, but I can call it a different one. Let's start with a C. I don't even know how to pronounce it. I don't even know if that's a magenta, but I call it a magenta. White, you know. Now we about to put it in the S-Bin bottle, so we can just dump it all in the tank like she doing. Okay, so for y'all that don't know, these are the ink bottles that came with the printer. And what we gonna have to do is we're gonna have to open them up and dump them all out, man. We're gonna have to dump them all out. We hate to see ink go to waste. Could put it in a different bottle, but we're dumping them all out. All right, so actually it was simple as hell. All you gotta do is like lift these up type shit. Flick them up. And that's how you do it. So I'm gonna just flick all these up. Okay, now we gonna go ahead and loop. Uh-oh. Why they ain't working with me, man? What's going on? Maybe I just don't know how to do this shit. Mm, it's not looking too good, my babies. We're going to have to watch the video and then come back because we fucking up. All right, man. Take two. Well, do you know what you do? I hope you do. All right, so this is how we enter the ink. Now that we know that gray is white and yellow is yellow, C is going to be C, hopefully, and magenta is going to be magenta. But you see it entered this one right here, PB. It's going to stay black. PB going to be white one. C going to stay C. That's going to be Y, yellow. Magenta going to be magenta. And then the gray is going to be white as well. So the photo black and the gray is the white. Hip with this bitch part of me. Ain't no militia 
winning, it ain't hard to see. Feel like Moses and I water up the stick and part the seat. I can teach you how to do a hitty just like Kevin Long. Mr. Walk you down, Cutty Step must got 11 times. Tell her I know we can't get the beef until you dead and gone. Put it on the floss, how you gonna knock me off? You bet it's on. Wheels back to back, gang, some Zotty blow. 308 hit doggy and it's top and knock this body out. In my DM, bought this bitch, but don't nobody know. 40 pounds, still be up and half, they brought the walkie out. Bitches know I play with cheese. All I speak is paper knees. I don't, don't give a fuck about no MSRE, play with fiends. Ain't no water guns, but we gon' wet them up, we spray with these. I learned making papers easy as I learned my ABC. Yeah, you're going Zotty, buy the bowl, boy, you ain't higher than. Now she like the way them Franklin's bust on my designer, then. If they tryna bug me for a shot, then tell them why her chick. We some motherfucking arm, now I still think it's been wider than. Maybe asking how the fuck he lit, but ain't no lighter with me. But this ain't no drill, we catch a gun, let the fire drill. Let him say it's up with DSM. But we go higher than them. I just check my bank account Bitches think I made it out Showing gang the way I GPS The way I made it out You would think this dick I tell bitch mad the way I made it shot You see all my niggas rocking chains But ain't no slaves around Bitch we dry as hell All these K's around <laughs> He keep up and fire, that's amazing, wow. But y'all know it's red, thinking I'm a fade to clown. Hundred rounder, pull up 30 thick, but I bang the crowd. When these 50s, hundreds, bitch, I got the money color cut. Hot as in my Arctic sun, but that's my summer post. We gon' ball forever, ain't no stopping like the buzzer, bro. California King Versace, she can't wait to fuck her on me. I just had to grab it, told her that little motherfucker poking. <laughs> No, for real, though. Sent the hundred shots and ain't hit nothing, boy. This jump out. Got a nigga, but I'm rich, so she gon' do her lover, bro. Money ain't the subject of discussion, you ain't talking to. Fuck my ex, but still a rocket ex. I had to off the hood. Catch him on a spark and watch him. Fuck you talking about? Hell yeah, nigga. It's on the floor. Bitch ass nigga. Hi. I don't hear shit people telling me cause I'm my own breed Mama used to work an extra shift cause I was hungry 